my Sagittarius's. Hey, my Yodas, the wise ones. What it do, what it do. It's your favorite, the one and only extra love coming through to see what's popping with you. What up, my babies? I miss y'all. How y'all doing? Ever so patient. And you knew you was up next too, didn't you, my baby? <laughs> you knew you was up next. I love you, Sage Jesus. My God. So let's get it. I see you are playful. You celebrating. You enjoying life. You having fun. And you're a star, my baby. You look so beautiful. Your light is shining so bright. I love you with my highest love. I see you didn't learn quite a few lessons, lessons, my baby, yes, and I see you won't and don't go through that again, right? I see you're independent, and the number one lesson that you gleaned is put the most high, your highest self, over everything. And you also learn to listen to your intuition, right, my baby? Um, when you, um, you learn when you accept the love of the universe as your primary teacher, you will always, always be guided back to the light, my baby. Yes. Suck it, man. Right, my baby? And you see that feeling good will take you much farther than whatever you thought you needed, my baby, out of you work in that solar plexus and your son and you and that heart chakra to the best of your ability. Green and gold are ever so important to you. Make sure you get you a piece of quartz, clear quartz. You know, for some reason it always comes out for you, my baby. It always takes center stage with you. You know, I see you encompass a lot, right, my baby? So getting into it, um, you got some powerful, powerful energy out here for you too. You got grandmaster dragons, guardian dragons, earth dragons, you know, fragments of you that are here assisting you at this time. I see you have a very strong connection to the divine realm, my baby. That heart chakra and that crown chakra is popping, my baby. Yes, green and purple and gold is very prevalent to you. So you got Asclepius, right? And this is the um, guardian dragon for transformation. Isn't that so Beautiful. I know you probably can't read it, but it's beautiful. It's it's saying a picture is worth a thousand words, right, my baby? Because what makes you unique, and and that's why I call you Yoda, the wise one, is because when you pray, when you pray for, or when you do your meditations and your prayers and tapping in, you not only send love and light to yourself, but you send it out to others. And baby, you know, that, that's a beautiful thing. That's what is accelerating your transformation right now. <laughs> definitely. You know, you're definitely a shaman. Just in case you didn't uh, figure it out, you're definitely good with plant energy. You know what I'm saying? You're like an earthbender, right, my baby? Beautiful. Beautiful. Standing strong, my baby. Isn't that, like, so succulent? And you know that this journey that you're on, on is only a journey that you can go on by yourself. You know? It's your journey to discover yourself. And that's why it's solo dolo missions out here, right? But you definitely rise into education. Definitely. Um, you also got Illuminata. You and Capricorn got the same energy. Most importantly, you got faith. Your faith, oh, man, forget a mustard seed, my baby. You got faith on a hundred trillion million, my baby. Yes. 
and you being steadfast and just knowing that, just knowing the truth, you know what I'm saying? And only the truth can stand the test of time. You're definitely a royal. You definitely tapped in. You know what I'm saying? Definitely got that Christ consciousness, Jesus Christ energy, the God in you, the Most High. Beautiful out here, Papa. I see you see the truth. No matter what, you see the truth, right, my baby? And I see a lot of people. <laughs> Um, they're tapping into the maple trees right about now. I see a lot of people um, putting taps in the trees. A lot of people on east is doing that. You know what I'm saying? Raking leaves. You know, making syrup. But I see you got courage, my baby. Say it with your chest. Look at that, my baby. You out here. So this earth energy... It's giving you the extra oomph you need emotionally. I, I was told to tell you to, to, to stand tall. Stand tall and be brave, my baby. And you are. You know what I'm saying? You're embracing change even if you don't know what the outcome is. You still embrace change. You're versatile. And that's going to serve you well. Uh, I see you have a mirage or a plethora of gifts and abilities and talents that have been coming to the forefront, my baby. Mm -mm -mm. Definitely, you got depth of character. Your abilities is litty, right, my baby, as we say. And you're beautiful. You know what I'm saying? I see you going to a family affair. Some of our family is going to, like, family gatherings or dinners and stuff like that, pop-ups. And some of our family um, are going home, like in the next week or so. It's definitely a planned event. And for even more of our families, a close friend is getting married. You just got your invitation. This is like for a friend that you grew up with. You know, beautiful, right? And first card that I got for you was Ace of Wands. That's like creation, willpower, you know, sparks flying. You out here, you got the light, right? And I keep hearing No Limit Soldier. You a No Limit Soldier. The sky's the limit. You know, some of our family members, they're... Um, Beginning like whirlwind romances, and you know, I see for you, my baby, uh, it definitely is like fulfillment. You're definitely original. There's nobody out here like you, my baby. You know what I'm saying? You're stepping into your power, and you have a powerful urge to create. You know what I'm saying? And you know, a lot of our family have new romance, new projects. Um, just trust your potential, my baby. But I see, you know, you been, you was dealing with the, it says a magician, but I can't tell. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I can't tell. This is like giving me mastermind energy, like a con art artist. Like a conjurer or something. Like somebody... Thinking of a master plan. Excuse me for wiggling, y'all. I might as well just keep it real. I got this hot water bottle. My back, my back is hot. You know, feeling a little something. Just feeling good, so I'm maneuvering with it. I didn't want y'all to think, you know, I'm already a wiggler, but I keep moving, right? <laughs> and this person is trying to make a connection with you, but they're kind of like manipulative. You know what I'm saying? You're definitely a co-creator, and this person is trying to co-create with you. They're planning on it out here. This is someone from your past. I'm hearing they have a, pa uh, a plan up their sleeve. You know, and for some of our family members, I see someone, like, sexting them. You're not going to say texting, but <laughs> sexting you. I feel like there's a little secrecy involved at the very least. Someone is not telling you something. Thank you very much. But you also got the death and resurrection card too, right? <laughs> right 
and I see you switched it up. You switched it all the way up, right, my baby? You had a major transformation, definitely like a butterfly coming out of metamorphosis, and I see it's big changes for you. You know, you got a rebirth out here, and what else? for some family members, you know, I see like death of a partner. Or death of a, a bond you have with somebody, if a strong bond. And I hear no holding on. I also hear security. I hear you saying security. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I also hear someone telling you your car has arrived. Your chariot has arrived. Right, my baby? I don't know if you're like a celebrity, a superstar. Um, it's making me thinking you, you're like into homeopathic things, like um, natural healing, and like I said, dealing with herbs. It, it really makes me think that you have a um, strong connection to the earth, like I said, the earth bender or something. But this is, like I said, this is like an ex, you know, that you let go and moved on from. It's going to be an end of a cycle. So you can get your beginning. And this magician, that's what it is. They're sexting you to either have intercourse for money or to have uh, intercourse like in a strange place. It's like crazy. To me, with the magician and the deaf, that's like tricking. You know what I'm saying? All day long. With the ace of wands, that's like tricking. But I see you learned your lesson. You know, it also makes me think that this magician is burning or have, like, STDs, sexually transmitted diseases, or sexually transmitted demons. Same thing. You know what I'm saying? But I see you're in, um, moving on to a new phase. And I see you're finding out secrets about this magician. Definitely in your power, um, communicative. And you definitely can manipulate energy, but you do it the right way because you, um, you're a problem solver. This person also, the person that's coming up in your past, it makes me think that they're um, like bisexual or something. We'll see how you're doing long. I just keep seeing trickery and strategy, right, my baby? So you made a commitment to yourself, my baby, to always put you first, as you should. And you got clarity, clarity about a situation. You see the truth, my baby. I told you you see the truth, the next card. <laughs> you can't, you, every time it's clarity, truth always got to come out with it. You see, see that, that's like an eye. See everything, man. Knew it was coming out. Because remember... Only the truth stands the test of time, my baby. But I see that you have to forgive this person and move on. I see you're letting go. They're finally letting go. You're already letting go. You forgive them. They have to forgive themselves, my baby. Ooh. <laughs> wow. You know, I love this car, Spirit Guy. You help others. You're a spirit guide with a spirit guide. Right, my baby? Spirit guide with a spirit guide. Bottom card, home. You're comfortable in your own skin, my baby, and you're looking at it. Oh, so sucking. Oh, so sucking, my baby. Yes. Woo, three of pentacles, recognition and reward. Right, my baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A lot of our family members are praying. A lot. And I see a couple of our family members, they're refilling up the bird feeders for our little bird family, our ancestors. Right, right, right. A lot of people getting their vision checked at this time. You know what I'm saying? So you got a little low-key, you got someone into a sword energy. That's like mental conflict. Somebody is not really feeling you out here shining, my baby. 
your throat chakra is all the way working. I see you teach or you give sage advice, but of course you are the sage. The yellow of the wise one. I get that name for nothing. Ace of Cups. New love, a new beginning. You got a portal, Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands out here. Yeah, ooh, ooh, yeah. Somebody in conflict because it's some shenanigans going on. Deception and envy. Someone was supposed to reveal something to you, my baby. And you see, you see that your, this is the third eye. You see that your success is really blowing someone's mind, right, my baby? They can't handle it. You know, because they can't. Because they haven't, because, you know, this is like a thing for several of our family members. You know, it's been someone that manipulated a relationship with you, and they had like a time limit to reveal it. You know what I'm saying? They didn't. They did not, my baby. So now they're in that five of swords energy, obstacles and challenges. It's obstacles and challenges to a love relationship you were in. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody sacrificed you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Somebody definitely sacrificed you. That's the truth. But now I see that the universe is here with you, giving you clarity. Definitely, your cosmic and galactic family is definitely here for you, giving you clarity. You're seeing that your nine of pentacles is here, success. You work for this, my baby. You know what I'm saying? Still, you keep seeing rainbows, you know. That's what it is. Whoever you're dealing with, they have a habit of sacrificing their prosperity. And another truth card out here. 20. Another truth card out here, right, my baby? You got the discernment and you got the truth about some commitment you were in, my baby. Truth out here twice. You got the clarity. Can't deny that which is true, right, my baby? Let's see what mama's saying. We, we, we working our way through. Self-love is the best world in this room. I see you're learning that, right, my baby? That's what you're learning with your connection. Self-love is the best love. You first. Abundance. Ooh, 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 another portal. Look at you. This is what happened when you feel good. This is what happens when you feel good in your life. You can make anything pop off, and that's the truth, my baby. Co-creator with the universe, divine sovereign being out here. Wow. Beautiful. That's what you co-created. <laughs> You're a spirit guy, my baby. In this lifetime, that's what you did. <laughs> Didn't I just tell you that? That's your path to help others. Wow, look at you. Wow. All because you're focusing on you, focusing on the love, focusing on staying in the floor. Love, my beautiful, beautiful baby. Beautiful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I just feel like, let me move this over. I'm stretching. Sorry, y'all. I don't know why all of a sudden I haven't, I've just been lazy, <laughs> feeling, um, chill mode, wow, oh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, look who you are, the empress, or the emperors, you know, energy is fluid, but you're sitting on your throne, wow, I don't even like, let me put it right here, sitting on your throne, Wow. You sitting on your throne. Look look how that devastated someone. You stepping in your power affecting someone like this. Ten of Swords. This is like fatality. You know what I'm saying? 
And you see you got a hater in the mess. You see that. You chilling, you resting, you meditating, you know what I'm saying? You see it. You in your room, you right by the window, you looking out. You A lot of our family members hear a fire truck coming past as they're meditating. But you got the message that your success is killing someone. <laughs> really. You know what I'm saying? And you got the lovers out here too. Woo, 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 woo. You know the stand and balance. Um, walking that middle path. You know, between your divine masculine, your divine feminine, your divine nature, and your lower nature. Definitely in balance. You know what I'm saying? 13. It's yesterday. Divine feminine. Divine feminine energy out here. You know what I'm saying? Death and resurrection. Mm-mm. Yeah, somebody, you got a hater in your midst that thought they was going to leave you fucked up, man. Look, let me tell you the story. This is crazy. You ready for the story? Okay, let me... Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Might as well come back around so we can get it together. I'm going to tell you the story. Let's we'll stick with this bit. Okay. You were already a star. Divine being and thing, right? You was working one day, you know, doing you. Woo, 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 right? And then you met somebody... It's the king, the king of swords, queen of wands. So you met somebody that, you know, had the gift of God, like a smooth talker. I seen they had like a, like a gray, like off-white gray, like foreign vehicle. They pulled up on you. You were um, getting gas or you was at the store. If some of our families was at the store, some of our family were getting gas. You know, you were just out and about, and you met somebody. And they was trying to um, push up on you, you know, because you suck your man. Woo, woo, woo. You know how it be. But I just feel like this person played off of you. That's that little scheme, scheme, scheme. plot, plot, right? You see, because you hadn't healed your inner child. So you was kind of like letting, you know, people run over you, you know what I'm saying? Had you all in your mind, all in your feelings. You know, you were giving love to this person, but they, you wasn't getting love in return, right? So even though you had the nine of cups, you know, spirit moved you away, right? Moved you away. So now, between... It's like six years later, right? Now you get messages from this person like, woo, woo, woo. I want to holler back at you. You know what I'm saying? Soon as you're successful, you got this six of wands, you got victory. So basically, you worked hard to get you where you wanted to be. This king of swords tried, left you fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Left you in a ten of swords energy. And you know this, right? You know it was because you have helped your inner child and you know what I'm saying, you let somebody gain you out of your energy. And you let somebody use you basically, right? Because you hadn't healed your inner child. So that's when spirit moved you away from this nine of cups, this relationship you was in, because it's clarified by the lovers, right? This relationship that you was in, spirit moved you away and killed that relationship. Definitely killed it. Abandoned it. You walked away. You know what I'm saying? Because this person has you fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Five of swords on your knees crying and they didn't even give it down. Because they were a hater, right? So now that you shine and you know, people always want, like I said, bust a hole and come right back, right? 
Because they see you shining. You're shining without them. They thought you were going to be all fucked up and devastated. And so they can come right back and get you right back into another Saturn cycle or whatever. But you curved them. You know what I'm saying? You wise. You know, no more juggling to a pinnacle. You know what I'm saying? You learned your lessons. Remember I told you, you, you learned that you won't and don't go back through the same shit. Because you know this person broke your heart and they only trying to come back and fourth quarter quarterback and ride your coattails because you out here winning with the Ace of Pentacles, right, my baby? See, you out here winning. See, because that's what it was. You was out here shopping, out here making them purchases. You bred it up like a fish stick, my baby. You out here doing your club thism a day in the life, right? So you ran back across this motherfucker from the past. You know what I'm saying? They tried to have you all trapped up in your mind. See, that's what it was. You, you were in love, and they were in lust. You know what I'm saying? This person, it's like, I keep feeling like a sex addict. Right? And this person has like a... Dark brown truck with like rims. I really want to say like... At least 26 inch rims. 26, 28, something like that. On their truck. And they got like... There's something about the paint on their truck or the trim or whatever. You know what I'm saying? They, they see you out. They see you happy. They see really... It really looked like you married. This is a couple, my baby. This is a foundation. This is like marriage, engagement, strong dating, or whatever. So the person see you out here with somebody, doing your thugism. And, you know, this person still loves you. This person, this is like an ex-spouse. This is a pinnacle. This is like an ex-spouse or something. You know what I'm saying? Somebody you've had a long-term relationship with. So they see you out. Now they stuck in their mind because now they see that you really was the empress, right? But they were treating you like the queen of wands, like a pop tart. Remember, this could be masculine or feminine. It don't have to be, you know, all about women. You know, our brothers' energy is fluid. So now this person, like I said, they're trapped in their mind. They remember how they crushed your dreams, broke your heart, three of swords. They see, like I said. You out here winning. You hanging with the homies. Y'all out here celebrating, partying. You know what I'm saying? But you wise. You know that you will never go back down that road. Especially with a hater. Somebody that left and took you back down through there. Because at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Queen of Cups. You're warm and nurturing and beautiful. And you know, stay getting these exes. You know what I'm saying? Stay getting the exes. Master magician. You're the master magician. This other person is an illusion. Illusionist. And I see on your journey, you have left a lot of people in the read position. People trying to come up and play off of your emotions, giving you the illusion that they want to be with you, but they only want to take advantage of you. They're coveting and envious of your life, your success, your beauty, your power, your positions, whatever you got. These are the type of people that hate you because you that you have an extra pair of underwear more than them. You know what I'm saying? But see, what, this, what messed this person up, because they got karma, my baby. It's because it was a spiritual bond. See, that was a divine union. But they didn't treat it like that. So, guess what? They got judged for that. You know what I'm saying? Judging is out here. Kill this. And that's the truth, my baby. That's the truth. Because this is you. Sitting on top of the world, top of the world. Queen of Pentacles. Didn't I tell you you was good? You know, you like a shaman, my baby. Freaking shaman. Yes. And this other person is not a pinnacles, you know, they dress nice, look nice, nice vehicles, nice homes or whatever, but they're empty inside. You know what I'm saying? They're empty inside. You took stock of what you put your energy in, and you know if it doesn't make your heart happy, drop that shit five of cups, and that's the truth. Another ace of hearts with the ace of swords. Another portal. You have an opportunity with love, for love. You got this little knight of cup over here. <laughs> That's really the king of cups. You know what I'm saying, baby? Beautiful. 
So yeah, this person over here is really the king of wands. They're like, I told you they're like a sex addict. Can we just say that? Wands, that's all they want to do. That's why you got these messages. They sent you so many messages about sex. I should have, could have, would have. Because they're going to have to deal with their karma. Yep. Because they were an ass-backwards magician, right? So guess what they get to do? They get to witness you with these nine of pentacles because this is you, you're the empress. You built this yourself, right? This is what they see. They're on the outside looking in at all that succulence, right, my baby? Seeing you go on off into the sunset. See, your chariot awaits. Didn't I tell you that? Security. You know what I'm saying? This you out here. But you're driving past them. Driving past them. Because you know why? They didn't do the inner work. They didn't heal their inner child. They never tap in. They're negative. Low vibrational. And they're not even trying. You, on the other hand, my baby, you put in work all day, every day. That's eight pentacles. You know how hard you got to work to get eight pentacles? Because guess what, my baby? You're the badass being a child of God. We need not go on. I'm going to give you a word of advice. Because your you're, 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 dream is cut and dry. Stay out the way. You in the Jupiter cycle. You're um, definitely... This is like... A major, major, major fortune. Major fortune. You, 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 you got some money coming out here. Love, let me kind of up, my baby. 